Today we're going to show you how to connect a Polycom Group Series 300, 500, or 700 codec and the Eagle Eye 4 12 times or 4 times camera with the sound control technologies Remote Cam 4 or RC4 E4P kit. The RC4 supports pan, tilt, and zoom cameras from all major manufacturers. It provides 1080p video, power, infrared, and RS-232 control up to a distance of 300 feet. Please take a moment to ensure your RC4 E4P kit includes the following. Now let's get started. First we're going to test the Cat5e or Cat6 link cable. Connect a 30 foot minimum distance link cable to the HE module only. Once connected, apply power to the HE module. This allows you to check the link cable for continuity using the provided sniffer. Connecting the sniffer to the camera end of the link cable should provide eight green LEDs. Any other result will prompt you to re-terminate the link cable. With the link cable confirmed, disconnect power from the HE module. Connect the confirmed link cable to the link connector on the CE module. Now let's move to the Eagle Eye 4 camera. We will need to connect the RCC-C030 Mini HDCI connector to the Eagle Eye 4 camera here, and the HDMI RJ45 connectors to the RC4 CE module here. Set up the HE module by connecting the RCC-H030 cables HDCI connector to the Group Series codec HDCI input shown here. Now connect the HDMI slash 9-pin connectors to the RC4 HE module here. With all the connections complete, you can now apply power to the head-end module. The Group Series codec and Eagle Eye 4 camera will take a couple of minutes to establish communication. To ensure the kit is connected correctly, observe the front of the HE module. The HDCP light will blink, indicating that HDCP is not present. The OK Link LED will blink red to green. The CE module LED will be solid green. You now have control of the camera from the Polycom hand control and video through the codec. Thank you for using the SCT RC4 E4P kit.